Yummy Lollies is uh, it's the healthy ice lolly company. We started back in 2006 um, as young mums, very frustrated um, about the lollies out there being full of additives, preservatives. It's kind of cliche really, but um, it was generated um, in actual fact because uh, I just had my second child, my son, Matthew, and uh, I was in the park and decided uh, that I wanted to have an ice lolly and for him to have one. And it was just kind of like a eureka moment, if you like, just walking through the park thinking, why can't I get something that, you know, essentially loads of mums make at home? And that's where it was born, really. It was born in a park in Brighton. A number of us got together and uh, decided to, to develop yummy lollies and, uh, and take it to market and actually got a first order. So uh, that was walking around with a, a wooden lolly with yummy written in it and then a tester pot in a well-known small yoghurt pot with a flavour tester and basically uh, got our first order. Yummy Lolly since then has developed and grown and um, I'm delighted with the, with the success. It's still a small, well-established business. Uh, we're still very independent um, and it's still effectively run by us crazy people um, here in Brighton. For me personally, um, it's amazing to see a Fritzik Ice Lolly in the school hall um, for children to, to choose. And it's fun, it's exciting, it's healthy, and it's a real treat for the children to be able to have after the end of their school meal. My favourite yummy lolly is the apple and mango yummy lolly. It's a manufacturing company of lollies, but it's a, it's a lot more than that. It, it has so many, it has certain values that are really important to the company, and they, they kind of um, oversee every decision that they make and everything that they do. Those, those values are, are to be honest, um, to never compromise, um, and to be real. And I think that in any decision they make, whether it's marketing, whether it's sales, whether it's how they deal with their customers, how they deal with their suppliers, and how they treat their staff, those, those values make, form every decision that they make. So for an employee with, with that in mind when they, when they manage me, it's, it's a great environment to work in because I feel like I'm nurtured, I'm cared for and my, what's important to me is important to the, to the company as well. We've been dealing with Yummy Lollies for about six years now um, and we find them absolutely fantastic to deal with. Very, very forward thinking, very, very passionate which is really, really key to pushing products and pushing sales and making sure that they back up what they say. From a distributor's point of view, we are consistently being approached by different companies to sell their products. What we need to look for is a product that is going to reach many different outlays uh, and many different customers. So when Yummy approached us six years ago, it was just a natural fit and we could see the gap in the market and that's why we've seen such good growth. We're very excited about the next six years. Uh, this year especially is very exciting because of the new packaging. We find the new packaging to be very, very powerful. It tells you exactly what the product is and it leaps out in the cabinet. It's honest. I know exactly that what's on it is what's in it. Also, none of my children like fruit, so for me it's a really good way of getting one of their five a day into them. Um, they like them so much they sometimes eat two at a time. And it's a healthy dessert. Um, why wouldn't I give them yummy lollies? If I had to choose a multi-pack, I would always choose yummy lollies. Um, you know, they eat so many of these lollies, it's such a cost-effective way of buying them. And I've always got some in the freezer then, I'm always stocked up.